What is up, FIFA commenters? Thank you for tuning in. This card is absolutely insane. He is lengthy, he's fast, he's strong, he has incredible dribbling attributes, and boys, you can build an incredible team around a card like this. Let's start this episode. If you're new around these corners, boys, you know how it goes. Drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and of course, do let me know in the comment section below if you're enjoying your FIFA experience at the moment. Boys, today, ESports has released a player that goes by the name of Matija Nastajic. I believe that is how you say his last name. Let's start very quickly with where this man has played in the past. It's pretty simple. Of course, he's a Serbian player, Serbian international. He graduated the Youth Academy of Partizan, which is a Serbian uh, professional soccer club. Before being sent on loan to Tereoptik, another uh, uh, Serbian professional soccer club, and then making his appearance with a big, big club. Fiorentina, where he signed for one season, did 26 appearances, scoring two goals, before moving to the club that probably made his career, Manchester City, where he was named Player of the Year in 2012-2013, as well as uh, won the Premier League in 20, uh, the, the season of 2013-2014. Sensational, right? And that really is what brought Schalke, Schalke to this player. And really, they were interested in picking him up. He did the most amount of appearances and stayed the longest at Schalke uh, from 2015 to 2021. 121, 22 appearances, scoring only one goal. And then doing a magical return to Fiorentina, where he uh, did pretty decently, but only did five appearances. And now has been picked up by Mallorca, where, boys, he is doing decently. But most importantly, for FIFA, has immense amount of links you can do with this card. Now, looking at the card we have on screen, 6'2", sensational, very good height for a center back. Low, high work rates. That is one of the biggest things this card has. He's left-footed, which is also rare. You know, you don't have that many center backs that are left-footed, so that's also sensational. Two-star scale, two-star weak foot. That's okay. Don't dribble with a card like this. Alternative positions, nothing to mention there. Only a center back, except if you want to move him once you start the game, minute one. Looking at the player attributes, very good. Honestly, incredible for a center back in a silver card. Look at that pace. 74 overall, 78 sprint speed, 78 acceleration. You definitely need to boost the acceleration. You could go ahead and put an anchor on this card. That would make it lengthy. Or you could put a shadow, but then he would be controlled. Looking at the passing, very decent passing, 78 short pass, 78 long pass, very good curve, very decent free kick accuracy. The dribbling on this card, let's move on to the to our favorite website in the world. And before we touch on what you see on the screen there, the dribbling, you can see he is high and average body type. That is okay. Like I was saying, if you put an anchor on this card, which will boost the pace, boost the defending and the physicality, he is lengthy. And I would really suggest you make him lengthy as opposed to control, which would be a shadow. Lengthy is the way to go, to be honest, boys. Uh, now, coming back to the screen here, defending is absolutely cracked. 84 interception, 83 same tackling, 83 slight tackling. All of this is fantastic, really. 80, 79 heading accuracy that you combine with the 89 jumping and the fact that he is six foot two, you're absolutely in the butter. 72 stamina, that is okay, boys. He is a silver card, but still, that is incredible with 88 strength, 85 aggression. And looking at the player traits, he only get he only gets injury uh, prone. Now, looking at what you will need to complete this SPC very quickly, it's very easy. Assist six goals in Silver Lounge, score eight goals, and finally win three matches in Silver Lounge, and you're good to get a card like this. What is so very interesting about this card, boys, like I wanted to show you earlier, is the fact that you can create such diverse teams around him. He plays for Mallorca, and if you remember, Kangin Lee is still in objectives right now. You can go ahead and, and, and get this card, which will give you a uh, about two chemistry points for both of these cards and then you bridge it to the Bundesliga with Lee Dong Jun uh, and then you could also bridge it back to the Premier League with Hyun Ming Sun right you could really create a very interesting team around the player like this you could also go the Serbian way where you could uh, pick yourself up a uh, Vlahovic which is only 15k and then a Sergente like voice legend says which is 21k uh, the inform 21k but this version the Qatar version 200,000 coins but that is A-OK, -okay, boys. Honestly, there's so many options that you can move uh, with with a play like this. He's incredible, really. For a silver card, 6'2", low high. The fact that he has this amount of strength, this amount of dribbling, decent pace, and very good dribbling stats for a center back. That is, boys, a very, very impressive. Boys, this was your FIFA commenter. Let me know in the comment section below if you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comment section below if you will be completing this card. Drop a like, subscribe. Let's try and reach 170 subscribers before the end of the week. Drop a like. Peace out!